But now you're home, safe and sound. And I have to tell you about this dream. Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, some of it wasn't very nice, but most of it was beautiful. Oh, and, and you were there, and you, and you. Yeah, that's how dreams work. <laughs> Yes, this uh, all sounds so fascinating, Dorothy. It's a shame we have to get back to work on the farm. Oh, well, all I kept saying was, I want to go home. And here you are. And now we have to go milk the cow. Oh, oh, oh. glad you're up, Dorothy. Yeah. Oh, but I had to go down a yellow brick road because a woman in a bubble told me to. <laughs> she was a witch, but she didn't look like one at all. Oh. Maybe that's my subconscious making me see all my assumptions about beauty standards. Oh, don't you think? Oh, and I totally forgot. Oh, there was a, there was a witch that she was, she thought that, that I was a witch and, and I guess that makes sense. Oh, and then I saw a dead munchkin hanging from a tree. So. Oh, see, come on, we were so close. I'm sorry, but it was so dark. <laughs> Dorothy, maybe you should talk to somebody about this. Someone like Hunk. Oh. Oh, yeah. Me. Cool. Yeah, totally. I actually, you know, I'm not very good at this kind of stuff, but my friend Hickory. A friend Hickory? Oh, yeah. Oh, friend Hickory is <laughs> so good at this. Oh. You should tell him all the deeds. Oh, thank you. Great. Hickory, I'd love your help figuring out the significance of the poppies that made me sleep considering I was already asleep. Hmm, gee, that's, uh, I don't know. Um, hey, Emily, thoughts? Uh, yeah, why don't you tell Emily about the poppies? <laughs> oh, okay. Auntie Em, do you know what the antidote was? Snow. <laughs> oh, wow. wow. Oh, 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 you know what I just remembered? The um, pregnant cow is due any minute, and someone needs to shove their whole arm inside its asshole to speed the process along. And I volunteer. So, everybody here have a lot of fun. <laughs> oh, and then there was a witch that started throwing fire at us from the roof. Not the good one, the bad one. Ooh. Actually, Emily, uh, I insist. Allow me to get the calf out by being elbow deep in cow feces. <laughs> Did I tell you about that bad witch? She was there earlier. Maybe I should back up. You know the cow fisting thing sounds like a five person job. Yeah. <laughs> well, there was a horse of a different color, kept changing. Maybe I'm changing. Guys, I'm sorry to do this. We're almost rain. at the door, but someone should stay with her because she might have a concussion. <laughs> yeah, I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> Which makes sense because I'm always trying to follow directions and pleasing people. <laughs> oh, and then, oh, and then the <laughs> wizard was going to take me home and then, oh, I don't remember what happened next. You woke up. Uh, well, hey there. Just wanted to check in and see how the girl's doing. I'm sorry, who are you? Oh, Professor Marble. Yeah, we don't know you. Yeah, uh, you think you could just show up to our house and ask about our 15-year-old niece? <laughs> oh, no, wait, I remember you from before the storm. He was in my dream, too. <gasps> oh, let me tell you about it. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm going to have to start from the beginning, though, because he missed an awful lot of interesting stuff. Oh, do, do tell. <laughs> well, my house was picked up by a tornado, and it landed in Oz, which was named after you, I think. <laughs> Or maybe you and me. Were Anyways, it was so different and very colorful. <laughs> Ruby slippers, yellow brick road, and Emerald City. You know what I think? 
I think color's playing an important part of my life right now. Come here, boy. Come here, Toto. Come here, Toto. Oh, Toto. Oh. Well, I should tell you about my dream. Fuck him. I'll say it in a way you can understand. Oh, you bet me! Oh, you're getting put down for sure! <laughs>